All right, today I'll make a short little video on how to wire up a switch on a swamp cooler. The uh, switch that I purchased is this two-speed cooler switch. Got it from Lowe's or Home Depot or somewhere. Since I couldn't find the original switch that came on the swamp cooler, this is all I could find to, to work. So. The instructions on the back of this weren't real clear, so I thought I'd make a quick little video to maybe help some of you guys out with your wiring. What I've done is installed the switch on the top side of the swamp cooler. Ran the wires from inside through some rubber grommets and grounded it to the side there. This is the diagram of the back of the switch and as you can see the black from the wall outlet your power source is going to go to L1. L2 is not used. The red low speed uh, wire coming from your motor is red and that goes to number one. The black hot wire from your pump will go to number two and the black hot wire from your motor which is your high speed motor or wire from your motor is going to go to C. What I did is uh, I wire nutted all of the common wires, the white wires inside of the box here. Just used a regular blue box outlet. And I also wire nutted all the common I'm sorry, the ground wires together and ran them uh, together in one lead to the side of the motor. So now everything works. Uh, hopefully you guys will be able to use this information. As you can see, here's the wires coming from the motor and the pump. Ran them through the side of the swamp cooler through some rubber grommets and now you can hear the pump come on you can go ahead and wet your pads before you turn on the vent for the motor and then Hopefully this helps you out.